Why does bond making release energy? This red sphere is a nucleus, a hydrogen nucleus to be specific. Here it is with an electron. The electron is negative while the hydrogen nucleus is positive. As their charges are opposite, they attract each other. The attraction between the two charges results in the electron orbiting the hydrogen nucleus. This is a hydrogen atom. On its own, the electron has more electrical potential energy than when it is orbiting the nucleus, as it is further away from the positive charge. When it approaches the nucleus, it loses some of this electrical potential energy. When this hydrogen atom comes into contact with another hydrogen atom, the two nuclei attract each other's electrons, drawing them closer until both electrons exist halfway between the two nuclei. As both nuclei attract the electrons, the electrons have a lower energy than they did when they were orbiting the nuclei individually. In order to conserve energy, the energy electrons had has to be released. The energy is released from electrons when they move from one position to another, as the movement of charges results in the creation of an oscillation in the electromagnetic field. This is called an EM wave. This EM wave is more commonly referred to by its particle name, the photon. Thank you for watching my video.